Hi, this is Tim. There's two different softwares that are used to communicate with Allen Bradley PLCs. The newer Factory Talk Links and the older RS Links Classic. Let's talk about the difference between those. Note that this is an excerpt from a live stream, so it is not perfect. And let's talk about communication softwares, because actually none of these three are what you communicate with a PLC with. There's actually two communication softwares. And so we have Factory Talk Links. So just start typing Factory Talk and you'll get it come up here. Factory Talk Links Network Browser. So this is a newer software that Rockle has come out with. And I, I like a lot of things about it. I'm, I'm getting used to a few things about it. But this will allow you to really connect to most modern PLCs with almost no effort. So while it's opening up, I'm going to open up the second one, and that's RS Lynx Classic. This is what a lot of people are more familiar with. So RS Lynx Classic. And the difference really is, while they've made this super simple, they haven't included the older drivers. So if I go to the configure drivers on this one, available driver types, you only see Ethernet. So that's kind of what this is made for, is it's made for Ethernet, and it also has USB right there. Whereas if our, in RS Links, if we go to communications and configure drivers, which is its a, you know, equivalent, and we have a gazillion, well, not a gazillion, yeah, I get a minute, there's only like 12 there, but there's a bunch of them here. And honestly, there are a few here that I have never used, but, um, but I, I assume they existed at one time. So this, uh, this has a lot of old school ways of connecting. And in Studio 5000, I always say, go to communications and then who active. Now, if you notice, well, as soon as we get this up, oh, wait, I gotta, I gotta cancel this because I didn't talk about one thing, is since we have two softwares here, this is the old RS Links, and this is the new Factory Talk Links, our newer software gives you the option of which one to use. And I'll say, if you're using Ethernet or USB, absolutely use the factory talk links. But right now we're gonna go over serial because let's say we thought this was the right software. So we're gonna select communication software and I'm gonna select RS Links Classic. 